Hi, welcome to another episode of David Rides a Trike. I'm David, and if you were wondering, I am riding a trike. If this is your first time watching one of my videos, let me give you a short introduction. If you're familiar with it, there is a skip intro link down in the description below. I make videos trying to motivate people with chronic illnesses and disabilities to get out, find some fun form of outdoor exercise, because doing so can be both therapeutic and it turns out to be a lot of fun. Just be sure if you're gonna take something on that you get the okay from your doctor before beginning. Personally, I fall into both the chronically ill and disabled categories. I was diagnosed as a type one doctor well, I don't know what happened there, but the camera shut off and I was totally unaware that it was no longer recording. So, I am recording this portion of the audio while you watch some video of me riding. I was saying that I was diagnosed as a type 1 diabetic when I was a year and a half old. I had a pancreas transplant when I was 41. I've had three organ transplants total. I am legally blind. I've had stage three cancer, which was successfully treated with surgery and chemotherapy. I've had way more hospitalizations for surgeries, procedures, infections, illnesses, than I can even begin to count. Right now I'm fighting a form of stage four cancer. It is spread throughout my body. Uh, it's in my lungs, it was in the lymph nodes around my heart, in my liver, on my bowel, uh, in the muscles of my thighs, and uh, I'm not sure where else. So I'm undergoing treatment for that and probably will be for the rest of my life. Well, today, as this video premieres, it's July 31st, and it's actually one year exactly that I've had this trike. It is an Ice Sprint X Tour. In that time, I've put on just over 2,400 miles, and I thought I'd do a uh, one-year review of the trike and just my thoughts about trike riding. So, here we go. The main thing... I think of when it comes to a review of this trike is the comfort. It is so comfortable for me. Now that doesn't mean it's going to be comfortable for you or anybody else, but personally I find this trike amazingly comfortable. I mentioned I have the cancer in my thighs. My legs hurt me virtually all the time. But when I'm sitting in the trike and riding, I have literally no pain. Um, so that is really wonderful for me. And the seat, uh, the seat is an upgrade from the typical uh, lawn chair-like web seat. Those are comfortable. This is even more so. It just kind of envelops you and feels like it's holding you in the palm of the hand. Uh, for a kind of weird analogy, but that's my thought whenever I sit in it. And for me, comfort is one of the keys when it comes to picking out a trike. I also love the handling of this, the feel of it as I'm riding. Again, this is something that's very, very subjective what is good for me is not necessarily good for you or anybody else but I find the handling very very accurate the indirect steering I greatly prefer over direct steering and I think most people who have ridden both will agree with that um, but overall those two things the comfort and the feel of the ride and the handling and also the stability. I believe the wheelbase on this trike is a little bit longer than a lot of other trikes and because it's so close to the ground it's very very stable. Now don't get me wrong most trikes are very stable. It's hard to tip over a trike. You have to work hard at it. But 
this one is especially stable. Next, I'm going to move on to something that is an add-on. Um, and for that, we'll go back to our regularly scheduled video. For me, getting the trike with the E-Assist really worked out well because when I bought this trike, I didn't know about the cancer that I currently am dealing with now. And because of the E-Assist, it allows me to still get out and ride decent distances and to ride with friends and keep up. With the cancer in my legs the way it is, without the E-Assist, there's no way I'd be able to do that. So, yes, that's a uh, uh, very rare case and a, uh, you know, not a reason for everyone to get the E-Assist, but I just can't imagine, as I said, riding a trike without it at this point, possibly even a bike too, although it's been a long time since I rode a bike, so it's hard to say. Um, the other thing that I absolutely love is the Roloff Speed Hub. Um, I don't have a derailleur on the back. The Roloff Speed Hub has 14 gears all inside of the rear hub where they're protected from the elements. It is maintenance free. It works absolutely flawlessly and the spacing between gears is even. In other words, when you go from gear two to gear three, it's the same uh, upgrade as going from three to four or 10 to 11. With this, you can also shift multiple gears at one time and you can shift when you're stopped which comes in very handy if you tend to forget to downshift when you're uh, coming to a stop. So, yeah, the trike itself is wonderful. Um, I highly recommend it. My feeling when it comes to buying a trike is to try out as many as possible and find out what is most comfortable for you. Um, that's a big part of the decision as far as I'm concerned. So if you try the Ice Sprint X Tour and find it comfortable when it comes to reliability and engineering, it is a phenomenal trike. Now, the other part of my review is kind of a different take on things. After a year, now I'd been riding a trike previously for several years, but after a year with this trike, if anything, I enjoy riding even more than I did before. Um, yes, it's still a challenge a lot of the time for me to get out and get myself moving so I ride, but it's honestly become easier. There are days I wake up and I'm excited to go out and go for a ride. And honestly, that was never the case before. Even though I rode a lot, rode a lot of days, put a lot of miles on, it was always a battle. With this trike, there are many days I really look forward to riding. A big part of that is the comfort and honestly, the e-assist. I feel like I could ride all day on this. I haven't yet, but it seems like I can. And the trike gives me the freedom to get out and enjoy days like this. I mean, look at where I am. It's 72 degrees, the very end of July. Weather is absolutely beautiful. I know you can't appreciate it, but Right now I have the smells of the forest. I can even smell some of the wildflowers as I go past them. So, in reviewing this trike, I feel like a big part of 
what I have to talk about is just riding a trike itself. And if you've watched any of my other videos, you know that I love riding. It always makes me feel good. And I know from hearing from many of you that it does the same for you guys. And that's really regardless of the manufacturer or model of the trike. You have a trike that you really enjoy, it's going to give you all those same benefits. Um, if you are in the market for a trike, I do strongly recommend you check out ICE's trikes. I know quite a few people, I, I think probably, and this is totally based on anecdotal evidence, but I think probably their most popular model is the Adventure, which is a little more upright than this. Um, I really like the feel of the Sprint because it is laid back and comfortable. It's slightly more challenging to get up and out of, but uh, that's a small consideration. And uh, as long as I'm able to do that, honestly, I'm a little bit proud of myself for that. So yeah, that's it. One year, if anything, even with my cancer diagnosis, I think I enjoy riding a trike more than I ever did. And that actually is in a good measure due to the fact that I love this particular trike so much. That's the Ice Sprint X Tour. And, uh, boy, I don't know what's going on here, but it's crowded. Let me just pull over to finish this. Nope, that's not a parking place. Let's see what we got, David. Okay, here we go. That is it, yeah. Um, hope you enjoyed this. Please, if you haven't already, subscribe. Give me a thumbs up down below. It helps my videos get seen, and the more they get seen, maybe the more people will get turned on to trike riding and uh, get outside and do something that physically helps them. All right, that's it. I'll see you on the next ride. Bye-bye.